So the theme at La Web is so low mo social, local, mobile. And here we have a company that uh, uses a lot of those. Its name is Flag Friend. Who are you? I am Olivier, Olivier Gattelman for Flag Friend and uh, I apply, I'm in the final of the startup competition. I present to you uh, Flag Friend, which is a new uh, geosocial gaming platform. Um, it integrates uh, social, local, mobile and fun. It's, uh, <laughs> remember 20 years ago, we all played Tetris on Game Boy and yep. they introduced uh, casual gaming uh, 20 years ago. After that, the next generation of casual games were more uh, added new features such as color, touch screen, or uh, 3D. But you always play alone to those games. Yeah. Or um, our goal is to to go to the next step of casual games, adding location and social. Yeah. So. Uh, it sounds interesting. And but first, tell me what the startup competition at the web was all about. Okay. Uh, I, the startup competition is a competition between more than 600 startups around the world. Wow. And we have been lucky to be selected and to be here today. So uh, we had a pitch uh, yesterday morning and uh, in front of a very, very high uh, judges, which was uh, impressive. And um, now we, we hope to be selected for uh, tomorrow, uh, tomorrow afternoon. Yeah. Uh, three startups could be pitched on the main stage, so it could be a great opportunity to introduce the project to everybody. Yeah, tell me a little bit about the game. You you play it, you tell it you're here, and then it shows you uh, some things to do to play with other people. So when you open the application, you have a map, and on this map you can see a little character that is your avatar uh, that shows your position. Around you can see the important places such as coffees. Uh, shops or uh, for example here we can see the web and the web is uh, the, each week the goal is to capture a maximum of places so uh, but now checking in is not enough to capture places you have to play a game and okay. what you have to know is each place is linked to a game so um, we have we built lots of games heaps of games to uh, and we link them to, to places and we have like educational games, uh, random games, uh, skills games, so everyone can play. And the rule is the game has to be short and fun. Yeah, and uh, it's a lot of fun. You, you actually use me in one of the games here at yeah. Lab, right? <laughs> we want to make a surprise for you. <laughs> and um, we've, we've built a game uh, today, and um, the goal of this game is to help you to get on the stage. And you can, uh, in this game, you have two, um, Two capacities: you can jump or fly. Jump through thanks to uh, your camera because yeah. we uh, we see you all the time. Yeah, you see me jumping up and yeah. down, uh, and you, it's sort of a, it's it's a copy of some of the other kinds of jumping it's games. It's kind you've of seen platform it. game. Yeah, is this going to be a platform where other people can play it can build games that stick in on certain kinds of places? Like, could Starbucks build a Starbucks game that goes inside the Starbucks? Worldwide, each each Starbucks location. Yeah, as you said, exactly. We we can brand uh, games. So for local businesses or big brands, if you want to communicate, uh, you can use uh, your game. It's a, it's a new way of communication. It's more local. It's more fun, and it's more engaging as well, because people are playing with the brand and brand with the business. And at the end, those business can reward the the good and the talent of the users. Yeah. Unlike other games, can you uh, lock it to a location? Can you say this can only be played if you walk in the door or are in this actual location? You can play uh, 350 meters around you. Yeah. But you can play more far, but if you want to play more far, you have to pay virtual coins. Ah. It's about a gameplay. A business model is based on our, our gameplay. Got so it. um, uh, it's, it's kind of a freemium. 
Okay. And uh, you asked a question just before about the, if we can add the new games, people can add new games. We are working actually now on an API to help developers to develop uh, new games and propose games uh, for okay. the application. Can you, uh, can you take games like Angry Birds or uh, Cut the Rope and repurpose them into your platform? It's, it's, or? it's, new, it's It would be a next step to propose editors game uh, on application, okay. on our application. Okay. What? Tell me about the fundamentals of the business. How are you funded? Where? You know, is this a really this a really early company, right? You're yeah, just building. The we company. are working hard. Uh, we. I'm just uh, ended the uh, studies, so I started the company when I was finishing my studies. I'm really an industrial designer. I am love user interface uh, stuff. And now uh, we are a team of seven people. Very, you know, games are passion. So uh, all the team is made of very passionate people. Uh, for this, uh, for this application. So are you looking for funding? We, yeah, we are looking for founding for, uh, to meet lots of people. We want to introduce uh, Flag Friend to everybody, okay. and we would like to expand the, the game to, to the world. We, actually, the, the game is, is available in, in, in San Francisco, in New York. We opened the game yesterday uh, to help people to play everywhere. Okay, so right now it's limited to a couple cities because you have to do some work on the locations. Exactly. Is it available for iOS or what, what, what platform? For the moment, it's available for iOS, but we have soon finished the first version of uh, Android, and we are going to work for uh, for Windows Mobile next. And uh, Okay. Well, good luck, and uh, it'll be interesting to see how you, you do, much. how you build this company. And a uh, cool idea for a game. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, uh, Robert. Thank you.